Hey fellow explorers, it's Chris from TDR Explorer. Today, I'm gonna to tell you what is new at both Tokyo Disneyland and Tokyo Disney Sea for the month of May. So make sure you don't miss this one. So first off, we're gonna do Tokyo Disney Sea. You can see here we have Donald and on every one there's a hidden Mickey. So I'm not gonna tell you where this one is. Open it up and you're gonna see this information here on Disney's Easter. I have all the information on our website in English, so I'll just quickly go over this. There's decorations, and we have the fashionable Easter show in the harbor, and we also have this Easter egg hunt that you can get. It's 900 yen, and it's actually available in English as well. So just ask a cast member where to get it, and they'll be able to tell you. And if you finish it, you can get that little bunny bonnet at the top there that you can see. You can only get it from the egg hunt. It's a lot of fun, trust me. And we have decorations and stuff around the park. As part of the 35th anniversary, there's actually this little greeting that's happening that has all the characters in their 35th anniversary outfits, including Duffy and Friends. And this is in the Mediterranean Harbor. And you can check the times in the English Times Guide. They'll have it in there for you. And then we have this Happiest Maker. Um, I, I explained this in my latest merchandise video on how this works. Essentially, you buy the little necklace there and you go around to all the different statues that are both Disneyland and Disney Sea, and Mickey will talk to you. It's only in Japanese, but hey. And then this is just information about the fireworks show that's over both parks. You can just kind of wait for them wherever. It's all good. And if you ask for a free birthday sticker, you can see that there. It has a 35th anniversary design. You can ask any cast member and they'll be able to get it for you. And also a very quick reminder, next month, we have Donald's Happy Birthday to Me event, which is happening June 7th to July 7th. And it's at both Disneyland and Disney Sea. There's merchandise and food. I have more information on the website. I'll put a link in the description too. Keep in mind that the Tower of Terror and Journey to the Center of the Earth are currently closed at Tokyo Disney Sea. So Tower of Terror is closed May 7th through May 29th. And Journey to the Center of the Earth is closed May 7th through July 20th. I know, kind of sucks. But a revised strategy for the day, if you don't want to do Toy Story Fast Passes, you can head over to Sea Rider, the Nemo and Friends attraction. You can do that. Get a Fast Pass for that if you like, or just ride it. The wait time will probably be pretty low. And then head on over to Lost River Delta, where you can ride Indiana Jones and Raging Spirits. So that's a good alternative. And also, don't forget to do the Venetian gondolas. You won't be sorry. Open it up and you're going to see a whole bunch of information here. First, we have this 35th anniversary merchandise, which I have a full video on, so I won't go through this. But the 35th anniversary merchandise is at both Tokyo Disneyland and Tokyo Disney Sea, And also at Bon Voyage, which is just outside Maihama Station on the way to Tokyo Disneyland. So make sure you go watch that full video. And I'll put a link in the description for also the large list on our website. Over here, you can do this at both Tokyo Disneyland and Disney Sea. Uh, this is, you can make your own customized keychain. And you do this over in Lost River Delta. And you get to pick a base and all the different accessories that go on it. I recommend doing it earlier in the day because it does take them some time to make it. You don't get it right away. You have to come back and pick it up. So head over to Lost River Delta to do that. I still need to get mine. Now here we have some new t-shirts. Yes, new t-shirts. These are pretty crazy color, <laughs> colors and patterns. That's pretty awesome though. I love that. And you can see here they have different sizes. So they go up to 3L. Child sizes up to 3L. 3L is triple XL. And for t-shirts, as always, I always recommend go one size up than you normally are in North America, just because it's usually length that is the problem, at least for me. I have to get a large. I'm typically a medium, but I get a large just because the length, it's too short. And down here, we have some new Snow White goods. It's like afternoon tea set themed, which is really cute. There's plates and cups and everything. Really, really adorable. And down here we got some towels, new towels that you can wear. And they're also UV protectors. Perfect for the summer because it does get quite hot and the sun is pretty strong. 
And then up here, we have our Duffy and Friends Happy Marching Fun merchandise. You can get this at Aunt Peg's, Galleria, and also McDuck's. And it's only at Tokyo Disney Sea. And these, these here are posable. That's really cute. Posable, Duffy and Friends. And then we have some souvenir plates and food, which you can only get in Cape Cod. So you can go and check that out. Got some plates, some cups, some milk tea, caramel milk tea, you can see on the right there. Nice water ball, cute. Down here, we still have Easter merchandise. I have a full video on both the food and the merchandise. So you can go and check that out. This is all still available till about June 6th, until June 6th. And then of course we got some food here, the Chandu tail, which is really nice. There's cheese and curry inside of it and chicken. Over at Miguel's we still have the Coco special set and you can see the rice there and it comes with sausage, salsa and all that, really cute. And there's also a little placemat that you can buy too that's extra, extra 500 yen. And then up here, really quick, some of the 35th anniversary food. Some of this is available at both Disneyland and at Disney Sea. And I do, again, I have another full video going through all of these, telling you where to get them and everything. And then of note, popcorn bucket, the special popcorn bucket for 35th is at Disneyland and Disney Sea. So you can get it at Tokyo at Disney Sea. And it's front, uh, it's in front of Lido Isle. So when you're walking towards Tower of Terror, Toy Story, that area, you will definitely see it at the fork in the road. Now for Tokyo Disneyland. This month, it features Minnie Mouse in a 35th anniversary outfit. And just like all the other Times Guides, there is a hidden Mickey on here. Open it up and you're gonna see information here on the 35th anniversary. I'll put a link in the description so you can read all of this in English. We have the new Dreaming Up Parade. So make sure you see that, it is fantastic, I love it. And we also have the projection show that happens in the World Bazaar. And in the evening, it happens every about every 10 minutes and it's continuous. So you don't really have to plan, you can just kind of show up. And they do it after sundown and goes right until park closing. So they do a special one in the early evening and it rotates, there's two different versions with like different Disney songs and stuff. And then near closing time, they do a special version with the 35th anniversary song called Brand New Day, and they alternate between a instrumental version and the vocal version. So check it out. And we have decorations all throughout the park, and then we have the special crunch shop in the World Bazaar where you get to customize your chocolate crunch kit. We get different flavors, and you can pick the tin and the ribbon and everything. It's super fun, so make sure you do that too. And of course, we have It's a Small World. It's reopened. Go check it out. And then we have some information here that's pretty much the same as Disney Sea, the Donald's birthday and stuff. And the special popcorn bucket here is with vacation packages if you book a vacation package. So you have to go to the official website and find out more details there. This month we have a few closures at Tokyo Disneyland. So Pirates of the Caribbean is closed May 7th through May 26th. To my knowledge, they're not doing anything besides refurbishment. We still have the old scenes. And I haven't heard anything of them putting in the, the new scenes that I know are at, that are at the other Disney parks. Then we have Space Mountain, which is closed May 28th through June 21st. And then the Tokyo Disneyland Electrical Parade Dreamlights is performing almost every day in May, except for May 11th. That's the only day it is not performing, so just keep that in mind if you're visiting. Open it up and you're gonna see tons of information just like Tokyo Disney Sea. Over here is the special keychain that you can make. And you head over to Monsters Inc. over there, and that's where you can do it. And don't worry, the forms are in English too. And we have more 35th anniversary merchandise. Again, watch my video and I go through all these in detail. You can find most of these at most stores in the park, but the biggest selection is in the Grand Emporium in the World Bazaar. So go there. And all the stores in that area will carry this merchandise. So make sure you head there. And then we have all the food, tons of food. Yes, tons of food. Again, I have another video that goes through all of this 
in great detail. We have this ridiculously long, long hot dog, the rush refreshment corner, sweetheart cafe. We have this cute Mickey bread that has different cream inside of it: the strawberry cream, chocolate, and cheese cream. And we have this Donald minced meat sandwich, really cute. And we have the stuff with the souvenir plates. This year at the Sweetheart Cafe. And we have these special drinks and churro. The churro you can find at different places in the park. And just like Disney Sea, we have the 35th anniversary popcorn bucket. This is in front of the Sweetheart Cafe, just outside the World of Bazaar. And this is also the Sweetheart Cafe, these like little cakes. Then we have this meat cone over there on the left at the gazebo in Adventureland. It's actually really good. There's beef and rice and white sauce on it. So good. And then over by Splash Mountain in Critter Country, right in the middle, you can see the Critter Country Sunday. I recommend getting that over just the churro because it's a cotton candy churro. They put half of it cotton candy churro in the Sunday, which I think is much better. I don't like churros anyway, but having inside the ice cream with strawberry and all this stuff, it's really nice. And we have this meat wrap, which I believe is beef. And then we have this Inari sushi roll, which is a cold sushi roll. And inside is sausage. And it's wrapped with a leaf and rice and also deep fried tofu. It's really good. And we've got some candy cases here again, various places throughout the park. And we have the It's a Small World Pizza, at Captain Hook's Galley, Tokyo Disneyland. And they are going through different countries making themed pizza. So the current one is from Italy. <laughs> and then we have the chocolate crunch ice cream and stuff. This is really good. So this is over at Ice Cream Cones in the World Bazaar. So we have the duck butt ice cream. <laughs> you can get a souvenir spoon. And we have this little smoothie. And there's also Daisy Duck ice cream cone as well. And we have just some regular food items that are always on the menu at all the different restaurants. Calzone. Yum. This is the seafood one. And then we have the towels, just like a Disney Sea. 2,900 yen, so about $27. Then we have some new memos. See they're Toy Story themed and other different characters. You can get this at the House of Greetings, which is in the World Bazaar. They have a ton of stationary stuff in there. Then we have these nice little outfits here. Those are nice. And just like Disney Sea, we have these new t-shirts and sunglasses and other accessories. And also we have the Snow White afternoon tea set merchandise. All right, Dog Sports, thank you so much for joining me as I showed you what's new at both Tokyo Disneyland and Tokyo Disney Sea. And remember, you can pick up the Today Guides right at the turnstiles when you go into the park. And if you're planning a trip to Tokyo Disney Resort, make sure you pick up my ebook at tdrexplorer.com slash ebook. It has everything you need to know to plan the perfect trip to Tokyo Disney Resort. All right, Explorers, I'm going to go inside and uh, enjoy some of the park.